Hi everyone, it's Ibrahim and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today's video, I'm gonna be talking about Samsung DeX. So perhaps you will uh, get every detail about Samsung DeX from its release uh, in 2017 till this moment in 2020. So let's get started. The first question is, what is Samsung DeX? Uh, Samsung DeX is a feature included in some Samsung mobile devices that enables users to uh, extend their device into a desktop-like experience by connecting a mouse, keyboard, and a monitor. The name DeX stands for desktop experience, uh, so it's made its debut on the Galaxy S8 when it's first released in uh, 2017 uh, so it's working on uh, Samsung on, on Galaxy S and Note series starting from Galaxy S8 however it has got many updates and in this video I'm gonna be explaining on uh, Samsung DeX which is built on Android 10 with One UI 2.0 Uh, the second question is, what do you need to run DEX? If you want to run DEX, you have many options to choose from. For example, Samsung offers some cables and adapters to run DEX. The first option is Samsung DEX Pad. You would plug your phone and you would have two USB-A ports, one USB-C port for providing power and an HDMI cable. And the pad has a, uh, a fan inside of it, so your phone won't get so hot while using it. The second option is USB-C multi-port adapter. You have one USB-A port, one USB-C port for providing power, and one HDMI port. The third option is a USB-C to HDMI adapter or uh, cable you have only a cable or adapter that converts from the USB-C to HDMI but there are some notes you should pay attention to uh, the first one is if your phone is running Android 7 or 8 you won't be able to uh, use USB-C to HDMI cable or adapter because uh, you need to provide the phone with uh, the power and this uh, this cable or adapter doesn't provide a phone just converts uh, from USB-C to HDMI port so the phone won't get any power except the Galaxy Note 9 uh, because it has launched with Android 8.1 with Samsung Experience 9.5 which supports these kinds of adapters or cables uh, just beside note also uh, maybe you could use the USB-C to HDMI cable or uh, adapter on your device if your device is running Android 7 or 8 by uh, using a wireless charger. However, I'm not 100% sure about this information. The second note is if your phone is running Android 9 Pi, you can use all the adapters that I've mentioned. Uh, I mean, you won't face any problems or uh, difficulties uh, when using these kind of adapters. All of them are working with the Android 9 Pi and fully compatible with it. The third note is that in case if you have the Android 10 with One UI 2.0 or 2.1, uh, you can use all the adapters that I've mentioned and also you can run uh, Samsung DeX on your computer uh, using only a USB cable which I've already uploaded a video about it you can uh, check it from here if you would like to now the third question is how can you run Samsung DeX? first not only Samsung's adapter can be used to run DeX 
but any USB-C multi-port adapter that has a USB to provide the phone with the power is good to go. Uh, in my case, I'm using this USB-C multi-port adapter, which is pretty similar to Samsung's this one. And I have uh, the USB-C to HDMI cable from Samsung, uh, and I will test both of them. So let's jump in. First, I will start with USB-C multi-port adapter. So you are going to block the HDMI cable with your monitor. Then with the adapter. You need to have a power. So block the phone's charger here. And block the adapter to your phone. Then turn on your phone. And switch to Samsung Dex mode. I will block a mouse. And I have a Bluetooth keyboard. So now you have a full desktop experience as you can see. If you disconnect the power brake, it will automatically switch to screen mirroring. Second, uh, the process of the USB-C to HDMI cable is pretty easy. Just plug it with your monitor and with your phone. A notification will appear so you can switch to dex mode. You can also use the phone as a touchpad. And you can either write using a Bluetooth keyboard or the phone's keyboard. The fourth question is, what's the experience of Samsung Dex like? Actually, it's just like a desktop. I mean, you can use your phone with different interface and it would be more easy to browse the internet. You would almost just, just like the computer experience for browsing the internet. However, it can't replace a laptop or a computer. You can use it for productivity stuff and for simple things, not for editing for example, because it's not very powerful. It's just a small machine. For watching YouTube or a movie, it's very good. For gaming, it's not a good choice all the time. Although some games doesn't support DEX. You can do some Microsoft productivity things by the Office package which supports DEX mode with almost full desktop version similar to the computer one.
Samsung also suggests to use these apps on DeX. So maybe they do support DeX mode better than other apps. That was all for now. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more tips for Android. And if you have any note or a question, hit me up in the comments down below. Catch you in the next one.